My name is Andy Hamilton, and I am the owner-operator of Musgrave Orchard. This is a 80-year-old apple orchard. I actually bought the orchard from the Musgrave family 10 years ago. When we first bought the orchard, it was conventionally grown, and we were able to transition towards organic production, which was our goal. We only have 300 trees. Sounds like a lot, but production orchards have anywhere between six and 8,000 apple trees, and it could have anywhere from 10 to 20 varieties of apples. We're somewhat limited. We're dependent on local orchards in the area to get the varieties of apples that people want and the right mix of apples that we want for our apple cider. But Regardless, apple cider that's fresh from the farm, uh, you can't beat it. We try to leave the cider house open so people can come out and take a look at it and get an experience of what this machine looks like and what makes uh, Indiana's finest apple cider. And it has for uh, 87 years. So nowadays they have these newer cider mills that are compact where we have this dinosaur. And from one end to the other, it's about 30 feet long. And it's got different components to it that uh, make up the entire cider press. We'll harvest our fruit and we'll put them in these big 18 bushel wooden bins, which can weigh a thousand pounds. The apples, as you open this gate, roll out onto this stainless steel table here where they get rinsed, any debris gets sprayed off of them, and then they land in this wooden hopper and it carries the apples up. So it grinds them up, makes applesauce, and it falls down through this chute right here. And so you build it 10 high and that pedestal press pushes all those costs up against this butcher block here. And it takes about a half hour for it to completely press all the juice out. And so if you can imagine that stack of apples being about three and a half feet tall, when it's all done and pressed, it's about a foot tall. So it squeezes almost every drop of juice out of the apples. We make uh, apple cider and we win awards for it. It's just something neat to put in your orchard and say, hey, we make really good cider. <laughs>